true or false? Right? True, true or false? Is it time? Rashid, are you there with us? I am here. Rashid. Yes, I'm in the building. All right, all right. right. All right. Still in the building. Well, we got in our signs with us. Yeah, up the block. <laughs> <laughs> Still on the block every day, Rashid, ladies and gentlemen. Just so call we got out his uh, name, and he'll come. <laughs> we we have we. That's scary. <laughs> 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 okay. If um if you guys are ready, uh, let's start because I have eight questions for you and uh, these statements they are either true or false and you guys get to decide which is which by holding up your card but also stating for the people who listen to this uh, on uh, on the podcast whether you think it's false or true and yes. I also am very interested in finding out why you think it's false or true. So All right, let's do. Let's this. get started. Man, get it the in. edge of the penis head is called corona. Fact or fiction? Ah, uh, yeah, it's. Pff, I'm. I'm gonna just say it's true because if it's not called a corona, it it should be called a corona because, uh, yeah, it's like the perfect name. That's my two cents on it. Well, actually, I might be stupid, but I think it's right. And there's something in the back of my mind to be like, man, what's the name of it? Because I like I happen to see that during biology class or something like that and i remember like oh yeah that's like there's a name to it but indeed it, it might be but it might be not as well but i think it's true i would say it's true as well it's also worth mentioning i think that it's also the name of a beer that makes it uh makes it uh yeah it gives us an extra <laughs> dimension right now that corona let's have to your some lips. coronas for lunch <laughs> You know, but uh, uh, skip Corona, man. Yeah, I'm from the desperate. Never drinking Corona again, man. <laughs> okay, so final uh, votes. True. Yes. True. Yeah, you guys are right. It yeah. is Corona, yes. right? But what it is, is the literal corona. meaning of Corona? Because the, crown, like the sun has a Corona. Crown. All oh, right, 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 right. All right. Okay, then it makes sense that the beer is also called Corona. Yes, it's yes. just a Spanish word for a crown. Are you Latin. ready for the next statement? Yes. Yeah. Okay. This one is very elaborate, so listen closely. Okay. An MRI of a Peruvian mummified Quechka tribesman was found in 1996 to have a string of 120 petrified coffee beans, assumed to be ancient anal beads, in his rectum. Fact or fiction? Petrified uh, coffee beans, assumed to be in, assumed to be ancient anal beads in his rectum. Maar ook gewoon. Nou ja, ik, I'm again. I'm going to say yes, just because. If this is true, this Peruvian guy was living his best life, you know? 120 coffee beans up the ass, then you're <laughs> then you know how to enjoy life, right? <laughs> I just yeah. want this to be true. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Isn't, don't you think you had hundreds up your ass, dear? <laughs> don't, did you don't, don't you think that's enough? No, I need another 20. To be honest, I think it's false, and I'll tell you why. Yeah. Tell it's me. Rashid. So it is true, but it's yeah. probably 150 or it's 110. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. It's a trick question. I wouldn't do that shit. Yeah, yeah. All right. But so, but we we, we uh, turned our answers in. I'm true, saying true. And Urban is saying? False. 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 Okay, yeah. No, just uh, Teddy and I were playing Fortnite last night and then we came up with this one. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It's total bullshit. Right. Total bullshit. Are you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. But you do put a lot of a lot of things in, like the Quechka tribesmen. Is, is, like, is, like is it a real tribe? tribe? Is that a real? Yeah, tribe? It's a real tribe, and they're really right. from Peru. All right, all interesting. Right. All right, all right, all right, all right. But there's no knowledge uh, available to me that they even mummified people. So that that's oh, bullshit. Wow, a string of hundred and twenty. And Teddy was like, "Yeah, yeah, don't say marble beads. Say like petrified coffee beans." And yeah. I was like, "Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. tomorrow." <laughs> Terry, are you serious? If you're watching this, dude, are you serious? Yeah, <laughs> that's a good one, Terry. Okay, Shout the out. next one. <laughs> Shout out for that one. Yeah. Ancient Romans found it cheaper and more effective than surgery to boil a eunuch scrotum in hot water, as this both castrated him and shrunk his penis several sizes all at the same time. But a eunuch already has no scrotum, right? So mm, That's how, how they become a eunuch. Yeah, but they, but it says to boil a eunuch scrotum, but a eunuch already has no scrotum. To refresh my memory, what's a eunuch? A guy without uh, genitals of a person, right? Yeah, They're like basically a slave who guards uh, as this sexual. Uh, uh, but okay, let's skip that part. I just mentioned as this both castrates him and shrunk his penis several times. Times okay, uh, cheaper. Yeah, but uh, but yeah, I'm gonna say it's false. Yeah, because Sorry, it's uh, false. Like. I think it's false due to this. It won't uh, shrink, right? By boiling it. No. Right? When you put your when <laughs> you put your junk in cold water, it shrinks. Yeah, right. That's one thing I do know. Yeah. 
So it and gorgeous once you put it in hot water. What? Well, hard. first, first it does. Hard probably. to say. I haven't tried it out, but I don't like, think you should try it either. No, but no, 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 no. If it would, it, if it would have been only uh, castration, then I would think about it. But because of it, it, the scent is that it also shrunk his <laughs> penis several sizes, <laughs> it would be like prob- people would probably do this if this would work. Uh, because they think their their dick is too big. Maybe something. it's something for Mythbusters. Yeah, but uh, yeah, we're both saying it's false. Yeah, yeah it's uh, absolutely false. You guys. Are right. yeah. Also uh, from the increased mind of the Terry. Yeah, it's another Terry, Terry, uh, terrible Terry. Uh, Yo, creator. next one, next statement. Yes. A survey under 800 residents of Shenzhen showed that over 34 percent of the respondents thought self pleasure to be a homosexual act. Okay, but uh, in Shenzhen is where is that located? It's a city in China. A city in China showed that over. Oh, yeah, 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 pleasure to be on. Yeah, this is this is again something that that uh, with with different numbers, I'm sure it could be true, because I've heard this before that people have this idea that uh, yeah, that touching themselves is because they are a man. And they're touching themselves that they find that to be homo- homosexual. So, uh, yeah, yeah. But I'm not sure about the numbers, but I will say it's true. And Urban, what do you think? Ooh, it's a difficult one. This is the first one that I'm really like hard to say because it could easily be as much as false yeah. as it is true. But if I if I'm going to put my if I'm going to listen to my intuition, I think it's true. Mm. Yeah. Why do you think it's true? I think it's... Oh, no, no, no. Actually, I think it's false. I think Ooh. it's false. Sorry, sorry. Last minute recall. Yeah. Explain Ooh. Explain to me what, what made it tip for you. Um, because as I know, um, th- there there's a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of expression in, in, uh, in uh, Asian countries. And I don't think they s- they see uh, self pleasure as a homosexual act. I don't think they do. So I think that's the reason for it to be false. Yeah, I'm 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 um, these numbers are really doing a number on me. I mean, at the same time, <laughs> there used to be uh, theories about people doing that stuff. Yeah. And yeah, if you yeah. want to know what that stuff is that I'm talking about, then you should go figure it out yourself. Yeah, yeah. You can At pro- least uh, you'll you'll find it. There are some problems I have with this uh, thing as well. I d- I think I'm, I'm I'm sticking to my answer just because then we are we we have different answers also. But uh, I think probably the city of Shenzhen only has like 800 residents, and then <laughs> and then. And One of the biggest cities on the planet. Oh, it's big. It. It's big. <laughs> all right. All right. Well, then, then uh, I, I haven't, I, I haven't heard of the city. But all right, if it's the one of the biggest city, I'm sticking to it. It's true. Hmm. Okay. So we got case on true, yeah. herbs on false. Yeah. And uh, yeah, yeah, herbs is right. It's not true. Oh, yeah. It's not true. It's just uh, a fiction of Terry's imagination again. Once again, once again. Terry, but, uh, Terry, Terry. He really man. helped me out last night. <laughs> <laughs> he really helped you out. Shenzhen shown that over 30 responds. Nothing of this is... Uh, I, there was no uh, no, survey. There was no survey. Yeah. There's no uh, proof the, that the it's... The city w- of Shenzhen, Shenzhen yeah. doesn't even exist. Yeah, it does. It oh, does. Okay. It's where yeah. all, like, uh, no, all telephones are made and stuff. Oh, know, yeah. well... Next one. In certain rural areas of Colombia... The country, not the state. It is custom for young adults with a penis to lose their virginity to a mule or a donkey. Oh my. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's true because, uh, yo, everybody's seen the videos online, right? <laughs> what? Everybody's seen the what? videos online, right? Why do you even go to talk <laughs> right? <about this>? What? <laughs> right? Stop it, Seriously. That's you true. What videos? <laughs> you do not There's know the video? videos online. I don't want to know. What you watch on your day off? <laughs> no, no, yeah. no, bro. I didn't want to watch it either, but no. it just appears in yeah. your WhatsApp, you know. I don't have it to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> you need to get new friends. Yeah, yeah, that's 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 what I told my girlfriend, but she told me, "But those are your friends." <laughs> okay, okay. So, Urban Kay says it's true because he's seen some <laughs> shit on the web. Yeah, I've seen it on the web. I've seen and it on I'm, the interwebs, and, man. And I'm I'm also like sticking to it too as well because right. like. 
He he has a point, right? I, I mean, like I know the video. <laughs> what he's talking about? And it's like Dude, exactly the good <laughs> height, week we right? We have new hosts who watch like, like wholesome good, shit. It's like a good height. <laughs> no, but seriously, man, don't think that we're perverts or something like that. But no, no it's like the group. App you're in certain you're in, WhatsApp right? groups. Uh, yeah, it's, it, it's yeah. like you're 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 with these mules and donkeys <laughs> all day, right? What? No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you uh, you you came up with yeah, this question, man. Yeah, true. Uh, and I'm false. sad to say that you. Uh, oh, you're, you're flagging up a false. Uh, yeah, like I said, I'm I'm like if I would say it's true, I would have the same argument as K. Yeah, 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 but because of the videos, yeah. <laughs> it, it matters what answer is in your heart, Urban. Do you think it's true or false? I I really hope it's false. No, but I really do hope it's false. If not, that <laughs> it will give me a whole wrong idea of watching Narcos next time. It is true because <laughs> because there's no way uh, Rashid knows that it, that is not true. How how, again, how how would he check it? That <laughs> is not true. But then <laughs> again, he's talking that about reasoning. rural areas. Yeah, so there definitely is rural, to rural too. So that's where you have sex with a donkey, right? Yeah, if any place. I wanted to avoid to use the word urban. Yeah, my confused <laughs> urban. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's just. Oh, I thought the yeah. rural areas meant no, there were no, not, not. Yeah, not they're not urban. Sorry, yeah, no. they're not urban, right? <laughs> yeah, but I just is, uh, right, man. It's true. It's there, true. There's a whole Vice documentary on it. Oh how, my how, see? Yeah. yeah. But it is not good. I don't think it's it's it's, it's very. Uh, I think it's evil. Then nice. how how can the donkey consent? How can right. the donkey say? That's what's it wrong with this. Really. Terry, really? No, this is not Terry. This is this, this is, is real. Advice. This fact. This is reality. This is a. Uh, no, no, no. But like, uh, you came up with the question, right? No, yeah. Th- yeah, I came up with this one. I had to uh, have, uh, like, yeah. something as crazy in it like this. Oh, when I saw so the now, I now like, we now I have a I chance mean, again. Now I have a chance. Literally, again. this. Like if we were talking about blow my mind, this literally be yeah. like, Poof. yeah. But why? You seen the videos? <laughs> <laughs> but I just thought it was. <laughs> I just thought it was like no, one I do, random dude. But like, yeah. oh my god. Let's add to this that that we don't uh, condone this behavior. But uh, yeah, it happens. All right. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I can't even read as much text now. You made me uh, laugh so. Right. Okay. Right, right. Next statement. <laughs> <laughs> this one is about Dutch history. All yeah, right. well, not Dutch, uh, the, the country that was here before we were. Okay. Since King Rabbout of Frisia died oh. of a heart attack immediately after having a wet dream, until this day it is seen as a bad omen on the island of Tessel to have a nightly ejaculation while dormant. Yeah, that's like a wet dream, right? That's, yeah. that's the only way you can have a nightly ejaculation while dormant. Uh, well, like, wasn't... Uh, uh, the the story about uh, Radboud it made into a movie uh, yeah. just now yeah which which I yeah okay that's where I got the fact that he died of a heart attack immediately after the wet dream well that's that's that oh, this is another one of these things that I want to be true so badly that this is that this is true but nobody would accept this they, they would if this actually happened they would just are you serious erase it Tesla we're talking about yeah. it's the island where people go to <laughs> during vacation to do whatever God right? has forbidden right right yeah so why would they would they hold a, hold a grudge and and keep this story alive from uh, from then till now yeah so if I, so I think they're uh, yeah well then yeah they might believe that there might be gnomes as well. Yeah, I know. Right. Like I, 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 I know that. Luckily for me, we're in Amsterdam, so I can say that. But like, if I would be in Scandinavia or something, mm-hmm. like, I would have a problem telling them like, there's no such things as gnomes. Yeah, because they really believe in it. Yeah, they do. Really, yeah, yeah, they're really. You're really insulting them for. <laughs> but where are the gnomes? Like, show me the proof. Well, that's hard to say, but like, they really believe into it. All right. Uh, yeah, we both think it's uh, it's uh, false for obvious reasons. Uh, <laughs> obvious reasons. For obvious reasons. I can. I can. Uh, we can. I already explained mine. <laughs> he explained his. I would say, and mine was that uh, if this this is not true, because if if it was true, they would erase it from history. They would just like it's not. Too embarrassing. Yeah, they would okay. just they would just erase it. They would not. You we wouldn't know about this years after but if it is true i love it <laughs> okay yeah you're both uh, right it's absolutely false mm. the main reason it being false is that i do not watch movies with super bad audio production so oh uh, yeah is that I the wouldn't problem? go to the rub out okay let's go next statement in parts of north africa it is said to bring good luck to a student's academic career if the if they bury 
his fores foreskin at the vicinity of the university of his desire. Unbelievable. <sighs> this wow. is another one of those, like... Uh, Terry's mind or something, you think? Yeah, it sounds... Yeah, we already have one of these crazy... Yeah, things out of Terry's mind. Yeah, but then again, I know that there's a lot of... Uh, 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 ceremonial acts during, uh, uh. during, uh, uh, yeah, um, the facet. Uh, no, not the vasectomy, but uh, how did they call it? I think circumcision. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So you you have the tendency to say that it could be true, but uh, but I think as a matter of fact, given the fact it's North Africa, right? That's what I thought. It's so it kind of reminds me that talk, we're talking about countries like Morocco, for example, right. Tunisia, Algeria, Algeria, mm -hmm. Egypt. Looking at those people, no, I don't think so. He has to actually bury his foreskin in the vicinity. Okay, so he could take it off somewhere else. He can have the the circumcision happens when you're a baby. Wow, so he kept keeps his circumcision skin and then he buries it like. Uh, Man, like that stuff that <laughs> looks like a raisin, right? At that time, or like Does are you Sarek, Did you do this? <laughs> <laughs> Better yet, from Uganda or something. I wasn't born there. Wasn't oh, all right. <laughs> all right. Oh, yeah. yeah. Better yet, born in Aga. <laughs> well, so but, but better yet, are you circumcised, Rashid? Uh, everybody is, isn't isn't that the thing? No, no, I'm not. Oh I'm not. shit! No. <laughs> no. Oh shit! Team foreskin, sorry. Yeah, man. team foreskin, baby. Okay, uh, well, I'm going to say it is true. I don't know why. Because, 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 <laughs> because, yeah, I, okay, because I can't because find of reasons. reasons. I'm going to switch <laughs> and say it's wrong because it, it, I don't think, I think uh, taking off your foreskin is like uh, normal, but I don't think it's normal to like keep that until you go to Universal and put it in, buried in the ground somewhere, right? Yeah, be like, yeah, just put a raisin in the Yeah, floor. yeah, yeah. How small? How, how does that? The, what does the size matter? You have to bury it or not? If it's big, it's nah, just. Nah, it's joke. false because you keep it like oh, then like for say like uh, fifteen years, yeah. uh, probably more, and then you would have to mummify this little piece of foreskin as well because it would probably be dissolved by then. Exactly. Let alone the fact All that right. somebody might see it as a raisin that <laughs> might be dropping down on the floor, and <laughs> they'll be like, if no. it's buried. Yeah, so we're okay. uh, saying false. Okay, yeah, you're both right. Yeah. But there is a tradition in uh, Morocco, yeah. which my uh, grandmother uh, told my uh, told my mom yeah. when I was small. Yeah. My mom needs to keep the umbilical cord, mm. like, yeah. uh, the, what the fetus eats through. Right. And she should bury it near my grade school, so I would have <gasps> a <laughs> lucky uh, academical career as a child. Wow. That so there, there is she did that? Uh, no, no. Oh, no, that's no. why you were. <laughs> were that's why your like academic career was so bad, yeah, because she yeah. didn't she bury didn't, it. She, she didn't bury it. No, but the, my grandma was like, yeah, you should definitely go to the school, bury the umbilical cord in front of the door, and then, wow. wow did you did it with uh, your own kids? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. So that's uh, that's that's where I based it off of. Have you have any, do you have any regrets that this didn't happen so you could have a good uh, academic career? No, but I have a fun uh, story to tell at parties. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is, it is. Okay, next statement. Common internet-related terms such as cookie, Read me and rabbit hole originally stem from 70s 8 millimeter porn culture. Yes or no? <laughs> yeah, if it was just cookie and rabbit hole, I would have said yes instantly. But like read me, it has less like no sexual, sexual. Um, yeah, where thing. I can read between the lines. Yeah, man. like a read like, me, read my, read me, read me, body language. Oh, yeah, read me, like oh yeah, right. I can read somebody, of course, and just touching their titties and stuff. Uh, okay. I really stem from uh, in uh, pop culture. Yeah, it's eight millimeter pop culture. Yeah, no, it says porn culture, not pop culture. Oh, porn culture. Yeah. Uh, well, eight millimeter. Porn culture. Uh, but why? Uh, why does a uh, cookie has uh, a related term to it? A cookie, noem ze a pussy. Uh, they call a cookie, right? Oh, really? All right, all right. I thought it was coochie. 
A cookie they use as well. I want the, want the cookies, right? I think so. That's, uh, that's what I think. Right. And a rabbit hole is just a real, real big asshole, right? <laughs> down the rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah, that's like it's so big, a rabbit could fit down there. Yeah, well, I'll, I will say it's, it's false. Because uh, if it is true, I want all these terms explained to me in detail <laughs> by Rashid. Of course you want. Yes. What, the, what so. does Urban say? I think it's true. Uh, uh, why? Actually, because I have nothing to lose. If I'm correct, um, <laughs> case is leading 3-2. So the only no, thing I can do... you're not correct. <laughs> what? Yeah, I think you already had a lead, right? Yeah. Now nah, we'll Ur- re- resolve that after the oh. after the match. No, the, I'm just like, like I don't know, like gut feeling. You're, you're just taking a gamble? Yeah. Okay, dope, yeah. No, uh, it's uh, wrong, so case takes a point. <sighs> yes. It's uh, from Alice in Wonderland. It's all from Alice oh, really? in Wonderland. Yeah. Co- yeah, of course. Cookie, read me rabbit hole. But yeah, then, yeah, actually, yeah. it could be a in related term because I've seen a lot of uh, porn movies inspired by Alice in Wonderland. So yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, hey, there's, whole, a, there's a bit internet, of truth. Uh, could be. The whole internet is uh, based off of Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Strange. Okay, yeah, you guys drew. It's a draw. It's a draw. It's really? a draw. Well, so finally, we have a draw. Now nobody has yeah. to feel. Uh, <laughs> now, can, now we can just be ourselves it for with the rest of the time. Scissors. Not. Uh, hey, that's a very good porn name, man. Cock, yeah, he, paper, he scissors, actually won with the rock paper, paper scissors. scissors. <laughs> Cock paper scissors. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so uh, well, that's great. Finally, we have a draw. Now nobody has to feel bad uh, for the rest <laughs> of the show. 